Tesla just became the most valuable US automaker of all time. It is valued at a whopping 160 billion US dollars, which is more than BMW, Ford and General Motors combined. But this wasn't always the case, as just a year ago things weren't looking right for Tesla. Everything was seeming to fall apart, whether it was the controversy surrounding Elon Musk. Musk's statements misled members of the investing public to believe that it was virtually certain he could take Tesla private at a price of $420 per share, which was a substantial premium over its share price at that time. Or the company failing to deliver on its promises, like missing the production target or failing to deliver Model 3 at a price point of $35,000 US dollars. So what happened in the past 9 months that changed Tesla from a dreadful company to a Wall Street darling? The start of 2019 wasn't that great for Tesla. First it was announced that the federal tax credit will be cut in half for electric vehicles with a plan to cut it to zero by the start of 2020. And to counteract this, Tesla had to reduce the price of its vehicles which resulted in decreased profit margins for the company. And to make things worse, the global auto market had entered in a deep recession. With sales down for 13 consecutive months, and above all that, Musk was risking even more of Tesla's capital on building a gigafactory in China. The gigafactory would be China's first foreign-owned car plant without any local partners. After that, Tesla missed Wall Street estimates of revenues and sales were worse than expected. It reported $702 million loss for the first quarter of 2019, which was just months after Musk promised shareholders that Tesla would be profitable every quarter into the future. And the second quarter was no different. The stock was on a downward spiral until it finally hit the rock bottom in early June of 2019. Things started to change for Tesla in the third quarter when it surprised the Wall Street with a profit. But this wasn't alone the reason for a massive Tesla bull. In November of 2019, Musk finally revealed Tesla's long-awaited cyber truck which was the world's first electric pickup truck. Although the event didn't exactly go as planned. <laughs> oh man, it didn't go through. <laughs> but it served its purpose. As next day, everybody was talking about the cyber truck. And within a few days, Musk tweeted that more than 250,000 people have placed a pre-order for the cyber truck. But the party had just started for Tesla. As on January of 2019, Musk announced that its Giga factory in China has been completely built and will start shipping Model 3s to Chinese consumers within a few days. China's electric car market is very big, as China alone produced about half of electric vehicles last year. In comparison, the US only produced about 20%. And if Tesla can capitalize on this market, then there is no stopping Tesla. And this is one of the reasons why the Wall Street is loving Tesla. Tesla delivered nearly 360,000 cars in 2019, which is more than it had promised in the beginning of the year, and also recorded a profit of nearly 105 million US dollars in quarter 4. But the future of Tesla is still uncertain as the demand for electric cars is consistently declining in China for the past two years. And moreover, there was a huge competition in this market, from established players like BYD which is backed by Warren Buffet and BAIC which is backed by the Chinese government, Porsche has Taycan, Jaguar has i and new players like NIO which are selling premium electric vehicles in China at roughly half the price for which Tesla is selling is a huge competition. So the road ahead for Tesla is a bit rocky. But come on guys, when was the last time the odds were in favor of Elon Musk? <laughs>